Today we're opening a box that I have never opened on the channel. A special edition box of Dimension of Chaos. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. You may have seen that video where we opened every special edition ever made. Well, it turns out there was a couple made in Europe and I don't think that I got these for the video. Dimension of Chaos. I think I got one for Dark Illusion or something like that. I don't remember specifically getting this one. I remember it was really difficult. I don't think we actually did because I could never find an actual one available. So I wasn't sure if it actually existed, but guess what? Here it is. So because we didn't open that up, we're going to be opening up an entire box of it. So here's a sealed box. I also have this, which is basically another box of it that is not sealed. So inside there are 10 special editions. This is the one we're going to be opening because that one's sealed. This one's not. I mean, obviously this one's better for opening. But before we get into it, we do have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these three cards. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed. Let me know what you think about this special edition. It's a European special edition. Do you like it better or worse than the old US ones? And do you think special editions should make a comeback? All right, 10 mini boxes. So these are super weird. I remember we opened one of these weird European ones. I think it was the Dark Illusion, but it wasn't this set, I believe, because inside you get one of two super rare variant cards, one of the two, and then where does it say? It says 27 cards, three packs in one. If you guys remember this from that super long video, if you guys have not seen that, go check it out. But it was a crazy video, super long, so you might have missed it. There's one like weird pack in here. So I'm just going to show you guys rather than explain it. So we have one special edition. We get this. This is our pack. That is it. That It's just a clear wrapped pack. And what do you guys think? You guys like this? Or do you guys think that we should stick with the three pack? I mean, we don't even have them anymore, but do you like the three packs and the promos? It's a little weird. It, it really cuts to the chase. It really cuts out the pack opening experience kind of. I mean, because it's like, yeah, here you go. You're not opening packs. We have the, uh, I guess this is the promo. The engraver of the mark, the Kyubi. So I don't know how these really work because we only opened one of them. Like, will the foils be in the middle like a pack? Or I don't really know how this works. So let's just see. We got a Gradle Split, Despot 006, Savant Kepler, Super Soldier Rebirth, Super Soldier Soul, Cobra, Contract Change. These are not guaranteed foils either because it was 2015. Despot, we got the Kyubi, Contract Change. Gamma Seal, the Sea Turtle Kaiju. That's a good rare. We got the Cavalry of Reptier. And a Radiant, that's another good rare. So it looks like they just put all the foils slash rares in the middle and the rest, wait, oh, wait, foil. Yeah, because you do get a foil and a rare if you get a foil. Okay, so there's a Magic Spectre Cyclone. And is that our foil? Okay, Fluffle Wings, cool. Necro Slime, you guys remember those. Savant Kepler, the uh, Plush Fires Band. And uh, okay, Contract with the Gate. So that's how those work. It's pretty weird. I'm not going to lie, though. Getting all those big hits in a row is kind of cool. This is almost like opening a massive legendary collection Yu-Gi's World pack, kind of like that, except it has way more commons and probably costs way more. <laughs> well, at this point, maybe not. Maybe because the Yu-Gi's World has gone up a lot. So let's see what our promo is this time. Fright for Tiger. Cool card. Destruction Sword Flash. So these are definitely the promos. Samurai Drum. We got the Kyubi, The Thief. The Ignite Veteran, the Gradle Split. This is just so weird. Kepler, it's basically 10 large packs. Wild Vulture. If we get like a Ghoster in the middle of this, like, I don't know how I'll feel about that. Psychic Blade, Samurai Thief, Contract Change. Super Soldier Soul, is this it? The Samurai Cavalry of Reptier, okay. We got the Performal Pal, Second Donkey, okay, not too great. Raid Raptor Fiend Eagle, and will we get anything? DDD Duo Don King Kaliuga. I think this one's decent. And that's it. There's our super rare for the three packs. So I guess that's all we get. That pack was definitely not as good as the first one because we had some really good rares in that first one. Yeah, this is just weird. Like, I don't know how I feel about these. This is like, I mean, you're getting a lot of cards like real quick because we've already got like 50 something cards from those two packs, which is technically a six pack. So it makes sense. There's something about just being able to rip multiple packs. That's more fun. So we have a tiger. We got a destruction sword flash. Oh. We got the Shuffle Reborn, cool. Super Soldier Soul, we got the Cosmo Wicked Witch. Raid Raptor Wind Vulture, the Psychic Blade, Con Dark Contract with the King. We've got a lot of DD stuff in here, which apparently is pretty popular now. Okay, you, we've got the Savant Kepler again, that's a playset. We got the Shuffle Reborn, Swirl Slime. DDD Oblivion King, Abyss Ragnarok, regular rare. Toon Barrel Dragon, cool card. Rank Up Magic Raid Force, okay. And another Cal Yuga. Can we get a double foil pack? We haven't done it yet. Doesn't look like it. So we're so is it only one foil? Is that the most you can get, or are we just getting one every single time? 
Because we could get zero, I guess, technically, right? It says three packs and one on the back. So, like, I mean, three packs and one. That should mean that you can get three foils, right? I mean, that would make sense. I don't know if it's going to happen. You'd have to... I mean, in real life, if you got three in a row, that would be pretty lucky. So, maybe that's how it is here as well. Okay, this is sticking to my hand. We have another Fright for Tiger. That's three in a row. We got another Destruction Sword Flash. The same cards. Okay. Kaiju Capture Mission. There's Gamma Seal. Swirl Slime. Cosmo Wicked Witch. Wind Vulture. Split. Psychic Blade, Super Heavy Samurai Drum, The Mirror Conductor, Gradle Cobra, Gradle Split, Magic Specter Storm, Magic Specter Unicorn Kieran. This is a banned card. That's pretty cool. DD Burfamet. All right, Burfamet. Promo Pal Second Donkey. All right, and Gateway to Chaos. I think this is over a dollar, so not terrible. And will we get a second foil? Magic Specter Yada. So at this point. We have not gotten a second foil yet, so I don't really know what to expect from these. It's really weird. This is a learning experience for all of us. Unless you're from Europe and this is completely normal for you, then <laughs> maybe it's not a learning experience for you. But if you're from the U.S. like me, you've not opened these before, this is definitely different than what we normally see. So let's see. Uh, I said C a few times there. Okay, another Fright for Tiger. Okay, a lot of the same things happening. Destruction Sword Flash, Contract Laundering. The Pot of the Forbidden is a short print, I believe. DD Contract Change, Capture Mission. Magic Specter Storm, the Shuffle Reborn, the Psychic Blade. <sighs> Come on. Super Soldier Rebirth, the Magic Specter Storm, Raid Raptor, Wind Vulture, Veteran. DDD, Wave King Caesar. Isn't this guy in the, the Duel Links deck? I think he is. Assault, Blackwing, Kanai the Drizzle. Okay. Oblivion King, Abyss Ragnarok again, and. DDD, Rebel King Leonidas, and. Just another single foil pack. It feels like you can only get one foil every time it's been one. Like consistently one. Not zero, not two, not three. Just one. Like five times. That puts us at the halfway point. So if we can actually get something different than just one foil, I guess we'll find out soon. I think. Unless, I mean, if we go 10 for 10, one foil, it feels like that's kind of the ratio. Finally, we see this card again. It's been a while. Engraver of the Mark. Despot 006 is a cool card. Soul Claw. Dark Contract with Swamp King. Contract Laundering. Samurai Drum. Samurai Thief. Ignite Veteran, Savant Kepler, Wind Vulture, the Samurai Thief, Contract Chain, Soldier, Soul, Soldier, Soul, yeah. DD Burfamet, Rank Up Magic Raid Force, Gradle Slime. Can we finally get something besides the Super? I think we've only gotten Super so far. Cosmo Straw Man, it's an Ultra Rare. We finally did. And will we get a Super now? No. We won't. Okay, first aid squad. So how is this three packs in one? Someone explain to me. This seems like some sort of like scam or something. How can you say three and one when we only get one foil every time? I mean, the chances are that you would get one foil. I get like one out of three. You're probably going to get one foil. But like, it seems like the chances you would get like a zero foil box at some point would happen too. Or you get a two foil box. Like, it's very consistently one, which is very weird. I guess if you think about it, you would get 10 foils in the whole case, which would not be too bad, I guess. That would actually be pretty good. So maybe that's how they like averaged it out. I don't really know. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. Cobra, let me know in the comments how you feel. Soul Claw, the Kyubi, the Veteran, the Storm, the Wicked Witch, the Laundering. We've got the Contract Change, the Soul Claw. Oh, we wrecked some special bit. First one of the day, so we're not doing too bad. Help Princess, Toon Barrel Dragon, Super Soldier Ritual. We had some really good rares, and we haven't had much since to start. And a Charging Guy of the Fierce Knight. Will this, that's an Ultra, will this be the first time we have double foil? No. I am almost convinced. I'm almost there to the point where it's like you literally cannot get double foils of the Fluffle Wings. And another Fluffle Wings. Double Fluffle Wings. We may not be able to get double foils, but we can get double Fluffle Wings. We've had the best luck with this set, but guess what? Right now, we're not having too good of luck. I'm not going to lie. Had a couple of Ultras that are not that good. Let's see what we can get this time. Come on. Give us something that is that good. That's amazing. Look at this. You guys see this? Literally, what? Leave me alone! I literally I was shaking my hand all over the place and it was just sticking there. That's insane. Okay. Super Heavy Samurai Soul Claw, Psychic Blade. We got the Swamp King, Pot of the Forbidden Short Print, DD Swirl Slime, Magic Specter Storm, Savant Kepler, Super Soldier Rebirth, Swirl Slime, Ignite Veteran, Gradle Split, Toon Barrel Dragon, Gradle Slime. Wait, did we already see Gradle Slime? Raid Raptor Fiend Eagle, and. And. Gradle Parasite, and. Plush Fire. Okay. All right. I see how it is. Despot Jet. 
Two more of these very deceiving special editions where they tell you it's three in one. It's a three in one pack. Yeah, you got three whole packs in one, yet you can only get one foil. So you should definitely not buy the real packs where you can get three foils potentially. I don't know, possibly, but uh, who knows? Who knows after this? I'm not sure. Oh, whoops. We got the Samurai Drum, we got the Swamp King. Will we pull a Ghost Rare to change our mood? Samurai Thief, Magic Specter Storm, Wicked Witch. I still do need the unlimited docks, just saying. Super Ruby Samurai Soul Claw, the Death Spot 006, Ignite Veteran, Savant Kepler, Skilled Red Magician, the Samurai Cavalry of Reptier, Pendulum Area, and DDD Wave King, DDD Wave Oblivion King, Caesar Ragnarok. That's long. That's actually a good card. I think it's three bucks. Oh, you can get double foils! Scarlight, Red, Dragon, Archfiend, Secret Rare. That's what you do, guys. This is the key. You just complain the entire time. Eventually, you get what you want. <laughs> All right, maybe not. Maybe you shouldn't do that. But that was kind of weird how often we were getting one, and then we finally get a double foil. But it looks like you can get doubles, which is cool. Now the question is, can you get doubles of the same rarity? I guess you could, but we just got a secret and a super. So now I'm thinking maybe it's like you could get like super ultra secret or something like that and that's it or could you get like three supers i don't know i'm not sure i was fully convinced that we could only get one foil per pack at at that point but it seems like seems like you can get uh, other stuff so that's cool we got the tiger we got the destruction sword flash we got the rocks and special that's number two dang it the wicked witch we got the swirl slime contract change samurai drum veteran again Con we have so many copies of these cards I say that, and I don't think we've pulled this card yet. That's a classic Duel Links card. Contract Change, Capture Mission. These other ones we have like seven of. Shuffle Reborn, Psychic Blade, Super Soldier Ritual, the Giant Pearfish, the Radiant, there's a good one, and Evening Twilight Night. I think that's pretty decent. And another non-double box, but that's okay. It's okay. We got the Scarlet Red Dragon Archfiend. We can't complain. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic videos and weird product openings. Shout out to TCG Trusted Cards, Tonefo Show, Tomato Juice, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Daxter, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Ananda Tai Show, JT Cho, and Anima the Hallow. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.